America's spy agency, the CIA, has many secrets to keep. UAP are foreign drones, is an urgent national security problem. If it is something else, is an issue for science. The CIA recently admitted that most of the UFO sightings that have been reported across the world were actually real spy planes belonging to the United States. These advanced aircraft are unlike anything you've ever seen, from the Dark Star to the B-2 stealth bomber. Here are some of the most intriguing UFO aircraft that could change everything. The State Route 72 Darker, breaking news, Pentagon confirms anti-gravity UFO that no one can detect. It's known by many names, the Dark Star, the Son of Blackbird, or simply the State Route 72. And for a while now, it has remained nothing but a myth. Stories of this mysterious aircraft were whispered by insiders, but the US government was quite tight-lipped about it. The genesis of this aircraft takes us back to 2007, when news first got leaked that Lockheed Martin was developing a fighter jet that could fly six times the speed of sound. This new aircraft was to serve as a replacement for the State Route 71 Blackbird, the futuristic aircraft that was way ahead of its time, developed back in the 60s. The Blackbird was born from the need to create a long-range reconnaissance plane with which Uncle Sam could spy on its enemies. This became necessary after a U-2 spy plane was shot down inside Soviet territory on May 1, 1960, while conducting photographic aerial reconnaissance. With the U-2 gone, the CIA knew they needed a new plane that could fly higher and faster, undetectable by any radar system the enemy could develop. This was the birth of the Lockheed SR-71. Back when the SR-71 used to be in service, it was considered the fastest aircraft ever built, with a top speed of Mach 3.3. However, it has since been surpassed by NASA's X-43, which we'll talk about later in this video. But after serving the United States Air Force for 30 years, the Blackbird was eventually retired in 1998. And the search for a replacement began, at least according to official sources. The legacy of the SR-71 lived on in stories and tales of war, but very few had ever flown it or even seen it in action. That was until the world found out that the State Route 72 itself was about to be replaced by something even greater something that might just be out of this world. According to the rumors of 2007, this new aircraft would be everything the SR-71 couldn't be and more. With the legacy of the SR-71 etched in gold, it was quite impossible to picture a proper replacement that would dominate the skies in ways that the Blackbird couldn't. The State Route 72 is a hypersonic, high-altitude surveillance aircraft that can blaze through the skies at blistering speeds of over 4,000 miles per hour. However, unlike many of its predecessors, the son of Blackbird can actually reach this top speed faster and for longer. This means that by the time it's fully unveiled, it will be able to travel between the United States and Europe in an hour and a half. At this supersonic speed, aerodynamic heating can create temperatures hot enough to melt conventional metallic airframes. So, the engineers working on the aircraft decided to build the plane using composites such as high-performance carbon ceramic and metal mixes. These are the same materials used in building intercontinental ballistic missiles and the retired space shuttle. This way, the State Route 72 will not only be fast but also durable. The State Route 72 will also be similar in size to its predecessor, at over 100 feet long. But something about the design and capabilities of the State Route 72 prompts some questions. While much of the details are shrouded in secrecy, from what we know, it might seem that the United States Air Force drew inspiration from a secret source. Since news of the State Route 72 got leaked to the public, there have been many wild speculations about how the United States may be experimenting with actual alien spacecraft. Many conspiracy theorists have postulated that the Air Force is currently developing several aircraft using materials sourced from alien spaceships that crash-landed on Earth. Considering the incredible capabilities of the State Route 72, this might not be too far from the truth. Regardless of the origin of the tech or rumors of extraterrestrial involvement, the State Route 72 might be one of the most exciting projects currently in the works. But what if the son of Blackbird has already been completed and is currently conducting secret surveillance for the United States government? Although it's set to be officially unveiled by 2025, there's a very strong possibility that the State Route 72 may be in active service already, conducting much-needed reconnaissance while remaining incognito. Apart from the State Route 72 Dark Star though, what other incredible aircraft project could the United States be hiding from the rest of the world? Next Generation Air Dominance Back in 2015, the United States Congress approved more than $4.2 billion for a new revolutionary program known as the Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD. 
The idea was to create a replacement or update for the F-22 fighter jets, which had dominated the skies for decades. According to the information released by the United States Air Force, NGAD is actively developing four new technologies as part of its program. This includes a new revolutionary propulsion system, which will enhance electrical power generation while improving the cooling abilities. The second task is to create a system that can work effectively without human input. This means that the aircraft developed by the NGAD program will incorporate artificial intelligence, taking warfare to a whole new level. As stated earlier, the NGAD is also working on developing innovative composite materials and structures with an emphasis on building a low-cost design and manufacturing process. The final goal is to develop advanced radar, infrared sensors, and enhanced electro-optical cameras. Just like with the State Route 72, details of the NGAD are also hidden behind classified files and whispered secrets. But from the limited information available to the public, the fighter jets emerging from this program might usher us into a new era of warfare. These fifth-generation tactical aircraft will concentrate their low observable features in the wavelengths used for targeting by radar-guided and heat-seeking missiles. The NGAD fighters will refine the stealth capabilities at those wavelengths while also reducing the aircraft signature in other wavelengths that future adversaries may want to exploit. The new fighters will also feature twin engines, which will provide greater thrust as well as fuel efficiency than other propulsion systems. This twin-engine design will also incorporate high-efficiency engines and lightweight materials, which will help the NGAD fighter perform more effectively in the vast distances of the Western Pacific. Added to this, the aircraft will be able to travel great distances without having to refuel. This way, it will be able to conduct intercontinental surveillance without any hitch or failure. Since stealth is one of the major features of the NGAD fighter, Heat emissions will also be minimized to avoid revealing its presence as it cruises through the skies at blistering speed. The fighter jet hosts a wide range of advanced weapons for use in combat situations, whether battling hostile aircraft or surface targets. The NGAD aircraft will decimate any opponent, no matter how formidable. The weapons featured on the aircraft range from kinetic assault weapons to non-kinetic ones. It features an advanced electronic warfare system, which will direct lethal energy against hostile targets at the speed of light. Apart from that, though, the NGAD fighter is also equipped with advanced electronics for detecting, identifying, and defeating threats without missing a breath. In order for the aircraft to function at an optimal level, the NGAD fighter is equipped with several onboard sensors, including its electronically steered pulse radar, which provides the pilot with a detailed picture of the flight environment over great distances. These radars also help merge diverse indications into a display that can be easily interpreted, giving the pilot's ample reaction time and 100% efficiency. All of the above features will be wrapped in a digital environment, which will enable the engineers, assemblers, operators, and maintainers to really understand its technical features and limitations. As America moves further towards air domination, the NGAD might be the launching pad for these futuristic aircraft that look straight out of sci-fi movies. But that wouldn't be the first time the US Air Force would be in possession of UFO-like aircraft. B-2 Spirit Stealth Bomber Back in the 1970s, the United States wanted a replacement for the aging B-52 bomber. The idea was to design a plan that could carry nuclear bombs across the globe to the Soviet Union and be able to do that within just a few hours. Added to that, this new stealth bomber would also need to be nearly invisible to the enemy sensors. This huge challenge was undertaken by Northrop Grumman, and after spending billions of dollars over the course of 10 years, the legendary B-2 stealth bomber was born. This 172T wide flying wing dashes through the skies undetected by even the most advanced radar systems of the time. The design of the aircraft is unlike the typical idea of an aircraft you see in an ordinary airplane. The body is divided into three main parts, the fuselage, which is the main body, two wings, and three real stabilizer ERS, which are attached to the tails. The wings generate lift to hoist the fuselage into the air while the pilot steers the plane by adjusting the movable components of the wings and the stabilizers. By adjusting these components, the flow of air around the plane changes, causing the plane to descend, ascend, and turn. However, the B-2 bomber employs an entirely different design. It's more like a massive wing than an actual plane. This design ensures that the B-2 bomber can perform more efficiently than conventional fighter jets. Instead of relying on the separate wings to support the weight of the fuselage, the whole body of the aircraft works to generate lift. By eliminating the tail and fuselage, the B-2 is able to soar through the skies with less drag, making acceleration easier and faster. 
This way, the bomber is able to travel longer distances within a short period. We will continue more in the next one. Thank you for watching this video. See you in the next one.